Welcome to a video from the digitallifestyle.com. This is a real quick Windows 10 build video. This is build 20277 for Windows Insiders on the dev channel and this is an FE release well, from the FE release branch. I'm showing this here on my virtual machine because I've got my Surface Go which I normally use the testing on uh, which is on 21277 which is an optional update for Windows Insiders on the dev channel so when you um, go into Windows update you can actually see that as an optional update. The reason Microsoft are doing this is because because 21277 is on the RS pre-release which means you get in the preview features so we're going to get back some of those features like the new emoji keyboard um, the, the new emoji thing, the new keyboard, themeware, splash screens and some other new features. These new features aren't in the build so um, I can clear my error, just click on retry there. So I've got this build installed on here, and like I said, I didn't choose to do the optional build, so I've got this, which is on the FE release. So there's not a huge amount of changes with this, in fact, it's just more or less fixes. New features like ARM64 support are in the other build, the 21277, uh, and I've got a video of that as well, so you can go over to our YouTube channel and see that. So I just thought I'd highlight some of the changes that have been included in this build. There is uh, basically fixes, which are um, some issues with uh, volume level labels. Um, and there's also a fix for app updates with that error code. Um, so that's that's the only changes to this. There's still uh, some known issues. Some of these are, are applied to the other build as well, like this uh, extended period of update hanging. Uh, that's been on every release now for months now um, but I've still not seen those issues but anyway it's still there and also the same with the live printing, pinning of uh, live preview of pin sites um, there's an issue with uh, signing to Microsoft uh, account uh, with various apps and they're working on this managed storage uh, bug as well for showing you your volumes uh, in the new modern settings that is also on the other on the other build as well so that's it really for these changes so if you don't do anything you'll get the new build um, which is on the FE release you have to manually click that to install effectively to go onto the new branch um, so it's up to you which which ones you test once you do go onto this new branch you can't go back so um, it, but just be careful which which branch you pick because sort of, you can't flick between them effectively. You you choose one. So that's why I've got my main test machine on the new features with the, on this one, on this VM on that one. So that's it. That's a quick update on what's happening with build two hundred two seven seven for Windows Insiders on the Dev Channel. Thanks for watching.